Miami Dolphins must end up Xavier Howard's contract before he becomes a criminal. Miami Dolphins star cornerback Xavier Howard's title seems on police paperwork as an individual of curiosity in an unsolved Atlanta area shooting from final summer season during which nobody was harmed however one spherical pierced a baby's playroom. The house is owned by sports activities agent Demarius Bilbo, who represented Howard till the two parted methods over an enterprise dispute someday after October. Howard's title is within the June 29 police report about the shooting. So is Ray Gibson, 29, Angelica Brown, 27, whose automotive was noticed on the crime scene, and Leonardo, Ken, Underwood, 45, a Howard affiliate who appeared to keep in touch with Gibson a number of occasions on the day of the assault earlier than it occurred. Gibson and Brown shared an handle, in accordance to the police report, which misspells Howard's first title as Xavier. Cameras within the growth recognized an automobile registered to Brown as coming into the subdivision throughout the time the alleged shooting occurred. Dunwoody, Georgia, police on a number of events have requested an interview with Howard, however he has declined, in accordance to a supply with direct information of the investigation. The most up-to-date request was made prior to now few weeks. Xavian was not involved in this incident and there is no evidence to suggest otherwise, stated sports activities lawyer Darren Heitner, who's amongst Howard's illustration. The Dolphins, Bilbo and Dunwoody police declined remark for this story. Howard, 27, is just not suspected to have been contained in the automobile when a gunman allegedly fired into the suburban Atlanta residence. Bilbo, who two years in the past negotiated Howard's five-year, $75.3 million contract extension, was not at residence on the time of the shooting. But his spouse and son had been. Despite a bullet touring by means of a number of rooms, nobody was harmed. The youngster later informed police that he noticed a four-door sedan pull up to the entrance of the yard, and a black man sporting a gray hoodie, darkish pants and flip-flops leap out, the police report says. After the shot was fired, the person jumped again within the automotive and sped off, in accordance to the report. Police interviewed Gibson, didn't initially cost him and haven't been in a position to attain him since August, regardless of repeated makes an attempt. Gibson denied involvement within the shooting. Gibson's cell phone was turned off throughout the incident, however police pulled his telephone information and found that Underwood, a good friend of Howard, twice referred to as Gibson on the day of the shooting, together with shortly earlier then, a Dunwoody police supply informed the Miami Herald in January. Police tried a number of occasions to interview Howard about that, however he first declined to police in August, citing a bout with COVID-19, and has subsequently once more declined to be interviewed. Investigators contacted Underwood, and he informed them he has no recollection of the incident, the supply stated. They additionally reached out to DeAndre Fluellen, a Houston-based good friend of Howard, however he ignored their name. ProFootballTalk.com first reported the existence of the police report on Saturday. It's unclear if the matter will likely be investigated by the NFL, all gamers are topic to the league's private conduct coverage. Howard, one of the league's high defenders who tied the franchise report 10 interceptions in 2020, signed a five-year, $75 million contract extension with the Dolphins in May 2019, together with $39.3 million assured, and that contract runs by means of 2024. He's due to make $12.1 million in 2021. After changing into the primary NFL participant NFL participant since 2007 to produce 10 interceptions in a season, Howard is anticipated to ask the Dolphins to renegotiate that contract within the coming months, in accordance to two sources. Howard, who's now represented by South Florida-based agent David Cantor, would really like to earn greater than teammate Byron Jones, who signed a five-year, $82.5 million contract with the Dolphins' final march. Surely you still haven't forgotten about assaulting his wife. Miami Dolphins have to cut this blood clot. Don't let this disaster get in the way of the Dolphins.